Welcome back to A Random Stitcher. We are going to be doing part two of the unboxing from Fancers. Part one was included in Friday's Flush Tube, where I unboxed these three items. The um, cross-stitch kit from Spring Company. The tension clips and the scroll frame. So in part two today, I am going to put the frame together and I'm going to put this in the frame and I'm going to put the tension clips on it. I know um, there's some that uh, do not know how these works and these are my first so it's going to be uh, also a try for me so uh, let's see how it will all uh, work out I'm going to measure the frame and I'm going to tell you the prices also so for these clips tension clips uh, the price listed was £8.95 the cross stitch, 11 count cross stitch was listed at £4.95 the scroll frame was uh, £12.45 and I'm going to start with this and try to um, assemble it so uh, let us start with measuring things let's see how long it is this one is 55 centimeters long and this will be this other round one that goes this way and these ones are the sides so let's see how tall they are they are 30 and a half centimeters let's start with taking these out of the little bag so here we are so you can see there's kind of a uh, ridge is that called that? Here. And here you can attach these. Those will um, hold the fabric while you are rolling these. So, but here they are, two of those. Next one is this one. These are, it goes uh, side. So it goes here. And here. So what you do is you put this here, so like this, and you, know, you can roll it like this. So the other end, you do the same. And when you are done, um, you can take the fabric off and on without putting taking them this apart again. So it's only one time you do this. So other end. There we are. Other end. Okay. So I think it's almost it. Yeah, here we are. So here we are. Good. So let's open this bag. So um, if uh, you don't know how to do this, there is an instruction here. <laughs> so uh, yeah, it tells you all this to know. Uh, you follow the numbers. Number one, do this. Number two, do that. And yeah, so... Um, here we have screws and stuff, four of these with wings on, and these go here, so you can tighten this roll thing so it doesn't roll, doesn't move the fabric. So four of these, and we also have four of these, four of these, put them aside, and we have four of these screws. You can see here there is kind of a... It looks different here. So let us see what it says here. It seems that here, and you see here, this one, so this one here is where you put the wing screws. So it means that these ones go from behind and up here. These one you put aside. Good. So, first one, put this on and put one of these wings on here. And we 
time. Eh? Okay, that was one. Do the same with all, all four. So, now they are on. This four one are going on here when you have placed your fabric where you want it. So let's start with fabric. So let's try and put this in the middle. I think this is the middle. So I think here. Next one. So here it is. So now I have to roll it. So let's say we want it here. Let's tighten the screws. Good. Next one. Good. So now it is um, secure and now we have to do the same in the other side. So let's put it in the middle. That's about here. And it can be a little bit uh, tricky to put it in because it is a stiff fabric. Uh, compared to if you are using fabric that has not, no print on. This is a little bit stiff, but uh, yeah, you can see it's working fine. Good. So, and now we roll it <laughs> and tighten it. Yeah, so I think you can tighten it. Oh, you can do it like this. Just tighten, tighten, tighten. And then you tighten the screws here. And here. So, you can see it is already tight, but um, with the tension clips I also got, uh, you have possibility to tighten it even more by tightening it this way because now it's only here and you can always if you think oh, it's not quite uh, stretched enough you can always just loosen these and roll it a little bit harder um, often my husband does it for me because I don't have that much finger power so but uh, it's already fine now so these are the tension clips and in a set you get four of these two on each side and you get uh, four elastic uh, velcro things and a bag of screws yeah. little screwdriver very cute this is a set so you have this on the other one side and this on the other side and they fit together and then you use your screwdriver and screw this Found a tray from diamond painting. <laughs> Keeping them in so they don't disappear. What we start with is two of these in each side. Let's start with this side and uh, finish that. So the white side here goes down to the fabric. And um, this nice one, it comes in three different designs. So this here and the other one, the white goes underneath here. So I think the best way is to have this screw thing on top and the other one and this one under under this one and then you go like this and you take your screwdriver
now it's attached uh, they stick together it's not tightened but it, they stick together so they can hold it and the next one is uh, here Yeah, next one. Put this in behind it. So here we have two of them on. So this here, okay. So it is attached now. I'm going to do the other side and I will be right back. So I have um, attached them in both sides. And there were two sets of screws left. So uh, that's nice, and an extra <clears throat> little screwdriver turned, uh, yeah, it worked fine. So now comes this. <laughs> so we have two in each side. So and as you can see, they said three holes. And I'm going to use the top and the bottom. Let us see how we can get that to work. It's exciting. You put one in each one in this hole, in this hole, this one, this hole, and then you kind of stretch it as uh, far as you want, and you attach it back here, uh, Velcro, so it stays here, and you do the same with all four. So let me do that just a minute. So last one. So I think we need to loosen this a little bit and stretch it a little bit more that way also. So here it is. There is a little bit of excess uh, Velcro stretch in each side. But uh, when you're sitting and sitting, as long as you have it out of the way, it's really no, no bother. But it, it holds up so good, these uh, two here. Um, tension clips so good you can really really pull nothing really happens now I'm pulling all that I can nothing really it really really uh, holds it and yeah listen to that <laughs> we have drum skin here it's really really good so I'm very happy with this because uh, when you get this attached all four screws and you have uh, stretch here and here it kind of stretched the whole piece here so uh, it's not only a little piece here and here and here it's the whole thing that just stretches out so we have an even stretch and that's very important um, you don't want it to be uh, uh, stretched the wrong way uh, so your stitching will not uh, look look good so uh, yeah so what do you think? Do you like it? I really do. I really do. So um, $8.95 for these tension clips. It takes a little work to attach them with the screws. Uh, but when they are on, they just they really sit tight and hold the fabric fantastic. So you only have to move it when you have finished this big piece and, you know, I don't know how fast you stitch, but for me, it's going to take a while before I will have to move this. Um, so, yeah, £8.95 for the tension clips, £12.45 for the roll scroll frame, which is really, really good. I love this type of frame. I don't hold this. There was somebody who said it's heavy to hold, but I'm not holding this when I'm stitching. This is either attached to uh, clamps on my desk or I'm having this on my lap with some pillow under or something and then I'm just uh, using two hands stitching having the arm one arm un under one arm over so I'm not holding it it would be too heavy to hold so yeah 12 pounds 45 for the scroll frame and this beautiful winter piece four pound 95 I will not be starting this yet. <laughs> I think January or February maybe. Let's get past Halloween and Christmas before this. But it's a very cute one. Yeah, I think it's a very cute one. So that was it from me today. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was uh, clear how it works. I think it's brilliant. I'm really looking forward to using the side clips and um, this new scroll frame. So yeah, thank you for watching and have a wonderful day. I will speak to you in the next one. Take care and happy stitching. Bye bye.